Okay. Gonna have a bit of fire underneath of a, you know, we're using stainless steel. I mean, you can use any pan. Yeah, you can use any pan. Even no stick, it would be fantastic. A lot of people has it. Touch of olive oil. We won't season anything. We'll season everything after. That is the most important thing. And then we are going to add the actually meat. Try to do it skin down. Why should you do it skin down? Because uh, we want the skin to really roast because it releases even more flavors. This will make about about 35, 40 ravioli. It will be about like five, six a portion. So about like five or six portion, even more. And depends how you're making it. Okay, get them lovely and brown. I'm gonna turn them. Okay, I'm happy now with the coloring of that. I'm gonna have the shallots, then we cut, and a little bit of the pancetta, then we have cut. We're gonna add some of the rosemary and the pepper. And the salt. Okay, the whole thing is start sweating off. I got a little bit of white wine. Any dry white wine, it would be fantastic. Uh, you know, even I mean, don't, don't go for anything expensive. As long as it's not sweet, that's the only thing. As long as it's not sweet wine. So we're gonna have the the wine going in, and we're gonna let it reduce. If you have any dietary or religious uh, sort of reason not to have any alcohol in it, so at this point you just add just normal cold water, okay? And it will be the same effect. Clearly the wine add a little bit, takes away the sharpness of the birds and add really almost another layer of flavor, which is very important. I think gastronomy is pushing all the way through, all, all the time is pushing to uh, who's achieving the highest uh, sort of uh, consistency on matching different I think and it's just it must be more a natural thing it's just you know it's much I think it's more new gastronomy to me is more respect about the environment is more respect about the people who work on the environment this is what is the new gastronomy it's not like how many bloody things you can put together in the dish okay I'm happy with that we're gonna go into a mincing machine and we're gonna mince the whole thing the only thing that we have to do is to take the herbs off okay and we discard the herbs as much as you can then we'll pass these into a mincing machine a mixture then comes out just as you can see slightly dry we'll add egg yolks eggs and uh, and a little bit of cream salt pepper again to taste and uh, maybe a little bit of breadcrumbs if it's too soft but this is all done to taste remember then what you achieve when when you the whole idea is then the, the stuffing must be holding together so when you push it together with your with your hands like that, it must stay together. And you have to achieve a mixture that is like that. So you can see then it's all it's not staying together, but when you pushing it together, it becomes one thing. You must be satisfied with this flavor. If this flavor is good for you, then the ravioli will taste like that, exactly. Because from now on we're gonna envelop it in the pasta and that is the flavor. So you have achieved your flavor here okay so if you're not happy with the flavor here then you have to change it now okay